These are reasons why Deadpool has hair and each reason gets progressively more and more insane. The first and most reasonable reason and the most Deadpool like reason is that he's around everyone that has hair. Bro what are you talking about man? Now this may sound dumb but there's actually a good reason. Ever since Deadpool 1 Wade has always disliked his appearance and wants to turn back and it might be because he looks like an avocado. Now you might be wondering why didn't he wear a wig in the first two movies? It's because now he has one thing that he didn't have in the first two and that is family. Besides Bedlam everyone in the X-Force has hair and we see them in the trailer. Now obviously Cable and Zeitgeist are also not in the trailer but that's a different question. This means that Deadpool might just feel insecure about the lack of hair and decides to wear a wig. The second reason is that he's going through a midlife crisis. Though you can't really say he has a midlife crisis since he can't die but you get what I mean. In the trailer it's mentioned that the past couple of years have been hard for Vanessa and Wade. Now there are many reasons why it might be difficult. The most likely option is that they couldn't have a child or if they did it died really young. We know that Vanessa and Wade had planned to have a child in Deadpool 2 and that was his entire motivation behind saving Russell. Now this loss probably would have sent Wade through an immense depression and the last time he was depressed was when Vanessa died and that led to him doing a whole bunch of dumb things. However this time he has Vanessa to hold him back and you sort of get a form of a midlife crisis hence you get a week. Now the final and most insane reason is that this is not our Deadpool. In a film containing the TVA and multiversal variants of Wolverine, a variant of Deadpool wouldn't be completely absurd. Now why would the TVA be recruiting Deadpool variants? Maybe the TVA is using them to fight Cassandra Nova, but she might be trapping them in the void or killing them. So this Deadpool might be recruited to fight Cassandra Nova and might end up getting killed by her, leading to the TVA to recruit our Deadpool to finally vanquish her once and for all. But there's also probably another option. If we watch a trailer closely, we see that one of the Minutemen pulled Deadpool towards him while someone pulls Deadpool through the time door. Now this could just be Cassandra Nova having mind controlled the TVA and kidnapping Deadpool because there might have been a prophecy that her death is at the hands of Deadpool and so she could be going through different timelines kidnapping multiple Deadpool variants and this could be one of them. What makes our Deadpool so special that Cassandra Nova doesn't kidnap him or the TVA does recruit him or whatever? Well it's very possible that early on in the film he may have just fought off the evil TVA leading to the good TVA finding out about him. However we will get answers for this in the film but the one thing we can definitely confirm is that Deadpool with hair is unsettling. Subscribe and be sure to check this video out where I talk about the new Fantastic Forecast.